So for me, it was the opportunity to blend in Carnatic music and Western classical music, which I've never done before. Um, we've always done sort of du duets and, and solos and things like that, which were purely Carnatic. This gave us an opportunity to bring in a cello, a Western violin, by the way, writing notes for the Western violin and the cello, translating them from from Swaram, Carnatic Swarams to sheet music, staff notation music, very, very, very difficult. Very difficult, right? But 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 it was exciting that it actually all came through and it actually worked out. And I think um, I have learned a lot through this experience myself on on, on, on the sort of the intricacies of, of both genres of music. And uh, it's just the music that we were inspired by and that we enjoyed listening, um, bringing that as a performer with different flavors. and. Um, it was really amazing to see the level of passion put in by these students who have been learning with me um, in Bangladesh for this long. And um, they spent countless late hours on this and uh, they never complained much about it. So I'm really happy and uh, kudos team. <laughs> we picked Kiravani um, because it was, um, you know, the E minor scale in, in, in the Western equivalence. And um, I have listened to like a lot of concerts um, Western classical concerts. Um, um, Brahms' is Symphony Number no. 4. There's also Adagio for strings, which sort of starts off there. So I, I like, um, you know, that E minor scale a lot. Obviously, you know, Kalikiyunte, I mean, it's one of the best, you know, songs for that raga, you know, as a matter of fact, any raga, and, you know. And, and uh, we decided that the Charanam, you know, the Bhagu Gashira, that was sort of the, would be the sort of the icing on all of this Kiravani that we did before. So. And then working with kids, we thought it would also be nice to bring in a lot of energy through Tilanas. So that's the reason why we picked a Tilana Malika and tried to blend in some of the Tilanas that we have personally liked. And it looks like they also liked the lot because they would, each one would vote on their favorite Tilana during the practice. Um, it was a good experience. Um, I really like, I really think that this experience was unique because I don't really get to work with Western classical violins and cellos much. And so I thought that was really interesting because normally I'm just singing by myself or with other Carnatic singers. So this was really a new experience for me. This was a really nice experience because first of all, we're in a recording studio and then it changes like everything. So when you're usually in a regular concert, you don't have to do everything over and over again. But like in the recording studio with these mics and then like the sound editing was pretty cool. And then also Kirwani is one of my favorite ragams. So <laughs> playing Murdangam for that song, Kali Gunte, which is also one of my favorite songs, was just amazing. Um, it was unique because usually if you go to a concert, you just do your own part and it's done. But for these kind of stuff, you need to, it's not like that because you need everybody to be able to do it together. And even if one person messes up, it takes forever to get it all right. Um, I thought this was unique because, like like Arjun said, we're in a recording studio and we're not in front of like a thousand people. So it's really cool that we get to be performing. Um, this was a unique experience for me because I'm usually the classical singer. I've been learning um, music from Jay Shanti for like eight years now. So looking at it from a different perspective, the Western violin was a really uh, ch like perspective changing experience for me. It's really hard to bring out like the ragas and the specific tone of the song in a Western violin, so that was a bit of a challenge, but it worked out at the end. Oh, this experience was uh, unique for me because playing the, the Western cello, of course, uh, was just different. I've never played it with the Indian group. I've only played with classical and western group. I uh, had a lot of fun on the journey to the recording. Um, and it was really different for me because I've never recorded before, like most of the people here. I've been learning classical music since I was three, but not from Jay Shriyanti the whole time because I moved a lot. And I really liked all the ragas and songs. Um, usually these kind of opportunities don't come around to a 13 year old all the time and it's really great that they incorporated us in into this, this these great pieces and I'm, I'm really thankful for that. It's been six years since I've been learning violin from Vantage Prama though he recently said he couldn't teach us anymore 
and uh, he's trained us for many concerts to play live, but I think this experience has been unique. Uh, it's been a wonderful experience for me. I, I really would like to la thank Mrs. Jayashree and Mr. Venkatesh for giving me an opportunity uh, to play here today. And I really like the combination of ragas. It's just amazing. Mohan Kalyani, Kirwani, Desh, Basan Bahar, excellent ragas. So I'm really happy about it. Thank you.